Uh, so today is day two for you after surgery, right? Yeah. You're getting mm -hmm. ready to leave the hospital, right? Yeah. All right, perfect. Um, I just wanted to ask you some questions. So we, we try to get a, a review of all of our visitors in order to, you know, to s spread the awareness and get people to know and understand uh, what you went through and, and, mm -hmm. and how would you rate it from, from your side. Mm -hmm. So uh, how did you hear about us? Uh, on the face Facebook group chat, oh. uh, Mary Miller recommended you. Oh, really? oh, okay. um, and she highly recommended to look into yeah. yourself and mm -hmm. check out all your credentials. And I went from there, and within two weeks, I was booked to come and within see you. Within two weeks, oh, mm -hmm. really? That's, that's, that's fast. <laughs> so, wh where are you from originally? England. From England, uh, yeah. Where in England? Uh, near Preston. Preston, yeah, okay. And what, were you looking at other clinics before you came across ours? Uh, I did. I looked at one in Prague, um, mm -hmm. but I wasn't 100% that I had too many questions, they weren't being answered. So, um, what made you decide to come to us? Uh, Yasmin. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, she, she answered every silly mm -hmm. question that mm -hmm. I had. Nothing was too much trouble. She um, made me feel really reassured that from the minute that I get on a plane in England, what was happening every hour, um, being picked up from the airport, she made me feel that that's really safe, nothing to worry about. To checking in, um, and Ali, the driver, waited till I was all checked in and everything, and nothing's too much trouble for it. So this was my second question: uh, from from the time you landed at the airport down all the way to, to coming checking into hospital, everything was fine. Yeah. All right, all right yeah. that's good. How would you rate the hospital? Oh, fantastic. You're happy. Absolutely fantastic. Okay. Uh, no, the staff are wonderful, uh, even though. Now and again, the language bad, but we always got by, um, mm -hmm. you know, but there was only once or twice that happened. Mm -hmm. and, and everyone's so welcoming and really looked after me really well, made sure I was okay, even when I was being a little bit sick and reassuring me that it's not normal and everything. So, absolutely brilliant. How would you rate the surgical team? Oh, yeah. Not me, surgical team. No, no, <laughs> yeah, no they've, they've been. Uh, they are really lovely, but it helped me re really calm my nerves um, and, and said that you know, there's nothing to worry about, it's straightforward. Explained everything mm -hmm. um, several times to me, which was really good. Because this is what we aim. You need to be informed about everything. Mm -hmm. Being informed makes you know and expect what, what can happen. Mm -hmm. So this, this helps. This is a big part of the treatment and recovery plan. Mm -hmm. So that's why we believe in it. You have to be well informed. Mm -hmm. Starting off from the time you book, my admin team has to make sure that you know uh, the driver's name, the hospital, the, the, the whole process, how it goes. The colour of the car that he's coming in. Yeah, you have to. Yeah, yeah. It's your right anyways. Mm. So, um, uh, tell me about your recovery. How, how was it? How was it? So, this, today's day two. Day two, yeah. Um, how, how, let's start with today. How much recovery do you feel? Oh, a million times better right. than yesterday. Okay. Um, I was quite, but I, don't, I think the anaesthetic probably had a lot to do with that for me. Mm -hmm. um, I just wanted to sleep. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Um, it took a lot out of me. But I knew this morning when I woke up, I, I was more alert. Mm -hmm. uh, I was more with it. And I thought, oh, and I've got no pain. I yeah. didn't have any pain yesterday. You didn't have any pain. Right. It was just, so it was just. You didn't get the gas pain. No, no, I'm gonna touch it. Nice. No, no, nice. no, nice. I haven't had that yet, and I hope I don't. But Perfect. today I've been up and around. I I've walked around a few times today. Uh -huh. um, I was doing that at seven o'clock this morning. So. Right. So you're walking around. Is it, so yeah. Do you feel that you had surgery? No. Okay. No. Oh, Apart from the point. nausea. Apart from the nausea. Uh, so this no. goes away within within a day or two or something like yeah. that. Yeah. And it's not continuously there, it will come and go, especially mm. when you start drinking at, at the beginning, but mm. once you get used to it, it goes away. Yeah. All right, so you're getting ready to leave the hospital. I am, I'm yeah. happy for you, I'm really happy with your progress. And uh, we'll start seeing the weight going down. I uh, hope so. And you mm. expect a lot in the first couple of days, and then it, it gradually takes over. Your body takes over with the metabolism and everything. Mm. So don't expect the same amount of rate of weight loss in the first 10 days. No. It will slow slow down. It will be around, I say, one to two kilograms every week. Mm -hmm. uh, sometimes it's faster, sometimes it's slower. Don't worry. Mm. Uh, our, our, the most important sign that you're losing weight is your 
clothes getting uh, looser yeah. and, and fitter. Mm. Uh, your pants size are going down. So this, mm. this is how we know uh, it's going fine. And, uh, what, what hotel are you staying at? I'm staying at the Hilton. And then you're flying back to uh, England when? Uh, tomorrow evening. Tomorrow. 11 p.m. drivers picking me up. All right, perfect. And Yasmin's organized all that as well. I'm so happy with your progress. Mm. Thank and, you so and, much for everything. No, I really you're appreciate most welcome. it. Really appreciate your time and, and, and really appreciate you picking us uh, uh, I'm so uh, glad I did, it's fantastic. Yeah. You know, it's like a five star hotel here. Right, perfect. <laughs> We're happy that you're happy. Oh, okay.